In this video, I will show you how to create a pivot chart with a secondary axis. I will be using dummy sales data for the Tanning Corporation. I need to analyze the revenue generated by my sales staff for the previous month. As you can see, the data has already been created. I want the chart to be grouped by salesperson and show the number of products sold and the gross revenue generated. Well, let's get started. With the data selected, what I would like to do is I want to press go to the menu bar and we're going to press data. Then we're going to select the pivot table and the pivot chart report. Now, we're not going to select the pivot chart report because we need to make a modification to the pivot table. Let's click finish and that's going to bring us to the pivot table layout. Here, our row is going to be, our data row is going to be our salesperson field. The data item is going to be consisted of our sales and product. The, data the pivot table has combined the gross sales and the product under the data column. For us to achieve the secondary axis in our pivot chart, we need to separate the two. The way we're going to do that is we're going to drag the data over the data column over the total column. This will split the sales and the number of products sold into two. Well, let's press F11. That gives us a quick chart. We're going to close our field list as we don't need that. We're going to change our chart type by going to the menu bar, selecting the chart, then chart type. Click on custom types, scroll down until we get to line, column, two, axis. Press OK, and there you go. We've just created a pivot chart with a secondary axis. Just so you know what we're looking at here, this is the sales revenue generated by Alice Wonderland for $950, and with a total of two products sold. I hope you enjoyed this quick video on how to create a pivot chart with a secondary axis.